new music for NTU. This is this is Fly FM. Uh, I'm now here with Josh Kemp. How's it going, mate? Yeah, all really good, thanks, mate. How are you doing? Yeah, not bad. How was the set just now? Awesome, Sorry, we. Yeah. Uh, Missed it, but no, no, you know, we're here for you. Well, to be fair, let's be fair, there's so many awesome uh, musicians on today, but no, yeah, it went really awesome. Thanks. Um, by the end of the set, it was absolutely packed, yeah. Um, from pretty much from a lot of the people, hopefully, from Amber Ron that sort of came in. I chucked out a hundred wristbands and they've gone, which is wow. which is pretty awesome. And I've actually got there one, we on, are. <laughs> one on now, just saying, let's get that in there, let's get that in. Um, bit of plug in, in but no, I like the setup in there, it's, yeah, everyone's right. just chilled, sitting it's really down, intimate. it's really intimate, and um. That acoustic rooms and that room in general is mm. one of the main reasons that I kind of got into music in, in Nottingham really. Danny, who's kind of wandering about somewhere, she puts on with a guy called Al and a guy called Toby this night called Acoustic yeah. Rooms, which is on Mondays here. So if you're a budding, like, budding musician and want to try something, get involved. It's there you really go, a bit of plug in there yeah. as well. Well, you know what I mean, it's, it's what really helped me and, and this is where we are now. So, so. We, sp- we saw you last night at the Trent Media Awards, yes. yeah, but yeah, yeah. I'll come back to that in a bit. Um, so what's now ahead for the rest of the year? For the rest of the year, loads, loads of stuff. I'm writing um, new tracks at the moment, which one of uh, a couple of which which I um, yeah. debuted today. Um, and so I'm going to be working towards a new EP, but I don't really want to confirm that it's going to be an EP mm. until I'm, I'm sure that the songs are, are right, if you like. But yeah, loads of writing, loads of gigging. I'm going to be travelling around Europe, interrailing really? and, and busking and, and gigging uh, in September. Right. And then um, uh, over the summer, I'm in the States doing a bit of gigging. Um, not like um, mainly holiday, but I'll be gigging yeah. in sort of places like Nashville and stuff. So oh. there's loads of gigging on the go, uh, loads of writing. I'm, I'm writing a musical. Uh, at the moment, a uh, random, random uh, but uh, I'm writing a musical at the moment. So a man of many talents, apparently. <laughs> but just music, really. Uh, it fit me in uh, any other situation. I'm uh, rubbish. But uh, yeah, because uh, your music video, stupid, stupid. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Best music video ever. If you haven't watched <laughs> this music video, please go check it out. Do you want to just talk me through it? Because I find this story hilarious every single time. So essentially, my song, Stupid Cupid, um, is uh, I have uh, a couple of friends that were together at the time. Yeah. And I think everybody's had it where you have two friends that are the loveliest of people, but together they, they just, and you don't really want to say it, but they don't work. They argue all the time and they hate each other. And so I, I had this and I really like the idea of Cupid being a bit of an idiot. Yeah. And so that's kind of what um, came from the idea of the video, really, when I was writing a bit of a screenplay, as yeah. it were. Um, it was just the fact that Cupid is a bit of a muppet. So as you see from the video, we just had a, a pen. We had a. My friend has a penthouse flat that he rents, which yeah. is decent. Uh, and uh, yeah, and we just had a party there, and uh, I managed to convince my friend Adam to dress up as Cupid Aww. and roam around their house. It basically, it was so much fun. It just it just seems brilliant to watch as well because mm. you can just tell you you put it on just so you can have a right laugh. Just, just so. for banter. It, is literally, it was so much fun. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so yeah, Trent Media was last night. You yeah. drew, we lo- everyone at the Trent Media Awards loves you. Like everyone does. Not, Mate, that's not just you me guys are really good to think about. But right, so here's my question: If you think of the most random award you could ever receive, right, what would it be? Random award I could ever receive. Um, so that would suit you. That would suit me. Um, I think it'd probably be something to do with boredom, because uh, I'm not I'm not really very good at um, detecting when I'm talking about something that's not very interesting. Uh, so I'll talk at people uh, and then only like 10 minutes into a really boring conversation will they realise that I'm actually really yeah. boring them. So I was, I think, most boring man of uh, in the Nottingham <laughs> music scene. Most boring conversation yeah, exactly. in the music scene. Most boring person ever is, is the there award that go. I probably That's get. your award. Anyways, <laughs> cheers, mate. Dude, thanks, thanks a lot. Good luck with the rest of the year. Thank you. Hopefully we'll be keeping up with you. Yeah, you know, and have a good summer, guys. Yeah.